Ancillary is one of three pilot communities for village tourism, scheduled to undergo upgrades of the waterfront and front street. The upgrades form part of the village tourism community infrastructure improvement component. A check presentation of funds for the initiative was held in the village Thursday, 15th October 2020. Financing for the first village tourism hotel on the island has been secured. This project will form part of the transformation of ancillary backed by the Republic of China-Taiwan to the tune of U.S. $1,865,671 under the Bilateral Corporation Agreement Grant for 2020. Taiwanese Ambassador His Excellency Peter Shen handed over a check for the sum uh, to Tourism Minister and Parliamentary Representative for the area, Honorable Dominic Fede, during a ceremony held at the waterfront of the fishing village on Thursday, 15th October 2020. Ancillary will have the opportunity to host the first village tourism hotel right in the location where the police station building is. That's component number one of the project. There will be 10 bedrooms, and we will put this building up to tender to any resident who would like to run this facility as a small business. The rental fees goes to the village council, and so there's an opportunity for anybody in Ancillary who can come up with a brilliant business proposal to run that facility as your very own business. This will no doubt create uh, several jobs for the community. It will bring about a tremendous economic spin-off. Our shops, our bars, our restaurants are going to be better patronized by our international clientele. Other components of Ancillary's transformation consist of village square redevelopment, rehabilitation of the fish fry building, and a new restaurant to be constructed at the site of the old community center on the waterfront. The Ministry of Infrastructure, they have rendered this building structurally unsound and because the structure is compromised they have actually recommended it for demolition and so by next week we should be rolling in with the excavator and other equipment to demolish this building and let the transformation of a great restaurant begin and on the waterfront here another business opportunity for another business person in ancillary to come and to put a business proposal forward to the village council, working with the Ministry of Tourism, the Ancillary Development Foundation, and we will together determine who has the best ideas to run a proper restaurant facility on the waterfront. Speaking in his capacity and on behalf of the Prime Minister, Honorable Alan Chastney, Honorable Guy Joseph expressed thanks to Taiwan for backing the transformation of Ancillary. I must take the opportunity to say special thanks to the government and people of the Republic of China, Taiwan, for such a generous contribution in these difficult times. Further, when we came into government, we sat with the Taiwanese embassy and we said, while we love the tea canal projects and we love the footpaths, and we love the concrete roads. We also want projects that would be revenue generating, that would be job creating, not just in the short term, but in the long term for the people of St. Lucia. And they readily accept it. Ancillary is one of three communities on island receiving attention under the Village Tourism Project. Permanent Secretary in the Ministry of Tourism, Donna Linvite, says work to upgrade Ancillary, Souffre and Grosselet are part of efforts to refine St. Lucia's tourism product pending full recovery of global tourism. Village Tourism Initiative is a vehicle that the government will use to build local inclusion. Too long we have been hearing from community residents that it's expats who own accommodation properties. We want to ensure that you too get your piece of the pie. We want you to become self-sufficient. We want you to assist us in improving the linkages. We need to use the downtime that we have right now because of COVID to get ready so that when the doors finally burst open, we will have our fair, graceful, and stately position to announce that St. Lucia is prepared, that Ancillary is prepared.
The transformation projects for Ancillary are scheduled for completion in February 2021.